In this video, I'm going to show you step by step how you can create your own custom Kahoot. So if you've never created a Kahoot uh, game yourself, then this is the video you have to watch because this will be a tutorial how you can create it yourself. So the first step is when you go to your browser and type in Kahoot, as you can see here, the first link is kahoot.it. So when you go to this link, it brings you over to the player um, website. And if you are on kahoot.it, the only thing you can do right here is entering a game. So as you can see under here, it says create your own Kahoot game for free. So it's free, it costs no money at kahoot.com. So you can hit this link. This will bring us over to kahoot.com. So from here, this is um, this is the page. And as you can see, a lot of people, uh, a lot of teachers use this business or parents. Um, well, it has nothing to do with COVID, but these people use it the most. So if you're a teacher, just create an account by hitting sign up. I already have an account, but just enter in all the details you have. So I'm going to log in right now and I'll get back to you when I'm logged in. So there we go and I'm logged in. So this is how it looks when you created your account. And as you can see the big blue button here says create. So we are going to do that. Here you can start typing your, your uh, question. So I'm going to do a basic question like, what is two minus one? Just like this, you can create it yourself. And then you can also drag and drop an image from your computer. So you can also put a video in it. So you can put a YouTube link and when the quiz starts, the video will play. So let's add some answers. So let's do one, three. So just do everything how you like, but let's, let's do four answers for now. And if you want to select the right answer, just do it like this. And the one with the green check mark is the right answer. You can also do multiple right answers. Like you can also do all of them, but let's do this one for now. And as you can see, you can customize uh, some things on the quiz as well. So the time limit is 20 seconds. So this is basically how long they have to answer the question. Uh, it's you can do it from five seconds up to four minutes just personal preferences you can also um, yeah uh, set up points so standard is just around a thousand I think and double points is that I get twice as, uh, as uh, much and no points is a question that they don't get any points you can also select the answer options like multi-select or single select and you can also change if it is if it is a true or false so this is also very fun you can do a um, true or false question and then they only have two options so let's do this one again and here you can add a question so select it and you can select up to like i don't know how much but a lot of them you can do up to 100 i think or even more and then let's change the name so let's do uh, test one add a description if you want save it where you want the language and it's first only visible for me and then hit done and hit done right here and now it's going to validate and there we go and as you can see i get the um, error because i didn't fill in the second quiz but let's let's keep it as a draft Let's edit it first because I want to play it actually. And if you want to play it first, have to delete this one, just like this, then hit done. And now it will say, yeah, there we go. And then we can hit play now as a host and then select player versus player, one, one devices or a team versus team. But I'm going to do one versus one. And there we go. Now the game will load and people who know the pin can join. If this video helped you out to create your own Kahoot game, please leave a like, please subscribe, and see you next time.